this goes, the more twisted it gets. The weapon he's using is straight off a Thanksgiving table. I don't want to spend my life looking over my shoulder. We need to stop him. There will be no leftovers. That's the tagline for Thanksgiving, a holiday horror film. Those two words usually don't go together. Um, about the rampage of a killer dressed as a pilgrim on the attack. It is the latest film from filmmaker Eli Roth. So we have Jeff Teravinen joining me right now. One of the stars from the film. Like I said before, I usually wouldn't put horror and holiday together. They seem counterproductive here, but that's what we're talking about right now. I watched the trailer. It looks absolutely terrifying. So thank you for joining me. I want to know what it was like for you to film this and what it was like playing your character, Deputy LaBelle. Uh, thanks for having me. Yeah, it was an absolute ball <laughs> working with Eli. Everybody says this stuff, but it was. He's an amazing director and a great guy to be around. But yeah, it was a fun thing to work on, just like the movie itself. It's like a thrill ride, if you will. It's one of those things you want to see in a theater because it's got so many good scare moments, but also really good uh, thrill and, and terrifying moments. And on set, it was pretty light. It was just a good group of people. Well, that's good to know because some of the scenes are just terrifying. We're playing some of them on your screen right now. And I have to admit, initially, when I uh, heard about the movie, I thought, wait, this can't be real. And then I saw the trailer and I was actually pretty terrified. Um, so tell me what it was like with certain scenes there. I mean, I know they're they're pretty creepy. So what's it even like shooting some of those scenes where they get so gruesome? You want to give your uh, castmates hugs afterwards because <laughs> they can get so ugly. You know, you you're there, you're there talking to them, and suddenly there's entrails all over the ground. Oh. Like that. like, Come here, Karen. I'm so sorry. <laughs> That's gross. <laughs> Sorry. It's just such an interesting take on this whole thing. Um, I want to talk about the fact that this was based on a fake trailer that then turned into the real thing. Were you aware of this fake trailer? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I watched the original movie, Grindhouse and all that stuff. So again, when I auditioned for it, I laughed. I said, this is going to be a waste of time. I'll never get in this thing. Boom. Here we are. So yeah, it was interesting. <laughs> Okay, so we have to mention this, of course, Patrick Dempsey, a recently named Sexiest Man Alive. So what was it like working alongside with him? You guys have a lot of scenes together. It was tough because he's so good looking that the shine comes off and it kind of blinds you for a while. But uh, <laughs> no, nah, he's honestly he's such a down to earth guy, a great guy. We both raced cars for a while, too. And obviously he was great at that. So that was something for us to connect with in that as well. So. Oh, that's cool. You know, I feel like there's a lot of hype. People are really hyped up uh, about this movie, um, which I think is amazing, especially because, you know, we're heading into Thanksgiving. We're obviously heading into Christmas where I feel like everything is a little more lighthearted. This seems like something that should have come out during Halloween. So did you expect this type of response? It's almost like reverse psychology when it comes to the mood we're expecting to have the closer and closer we get into the holiday season. Eli's been cooking up in his horror kitchen there this for a long time. So, I mean, there was a lot of hype from, from uh, the original movie. So when it was released that it was coming out, yeah, you could see it online. People were so excited. I've been waiting 13 years for this. So it's really cool to be a part of another holiday tradition because I also played a bad guy in the Christmas Chronicles. So I'm trying to get all the holiday seasons in here before my career's over. <laughs> oh, my gosh, stop. <laughs> Your career is far from over. Thank you. Don't, don't raise your eyebrow like that. Your career is far from over. This is going to be a great movie. Everyone's going to see it. Everyone's super, super hype about it. And, you know, I am interested in seeing the full thing because I only saw the trailer and I was creeped out. And that's a good thing, right? That's what trailers are supposed to do. Get you excited. Get you hyped up. And it doesn't even touch it. I mean, my character plays an ex-special ops Marine. And basically, he's completely dumbfounded by how bad the killer is. So that gives you an idea on what you're going to expect in the movie. But it's fun, though. I just, I got to say that so many times people are saying, I'm afraid to go to scary movies and I can't see your movie. It's scary, but it's also fun. It's like a, like a roller coaster ride, if you will. You'll, you'll walk out having fun as opposed to being terrified and not being able to sleep. Okay, that's actually comforting. Plus, roller coasters are always really fun. So thank you so much. We ran out of time, but you're amazing. Congratulations. I know it's going to do really, really well. Um, and enjoy yourself with all the press that I know you're going to be doing for the next couple <laughs> of days, too. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks, guys. Have a great one.